an emphatic 2-1 win, another three points. Thoughts on the first half performance, though? Yeah, I, I thought it was a bit sluggish, to be honest. Um, whether the, the fact we turned up a bit late was was part and parcel of that, but you know, we don't really want to use that as an excuse. You know, the amount of uh, fans we've got travelling to games on a Monday night, we've we've got to deliver better. And, uh, and I said that to them at half time. We've got to, they look like they wanted it more. We've got to be on the front foot and, and match their work rate. Uh, and I thought we'd done that a bit better second half. And uh, just coming into the second half. Substitution of Darren Budd into the middle of the park. How do you think he came on and you know changed the game in a way? Yeah, we got a great squad. Great squad. Um, we brought 20 players with us tonight here. Um, so there's four not even involved. Um, you know, four that are coming back from injury. But it just shows you the, the the strength that we've got in our squad. And you know, Darren's in both games. I think it's been excellent since he's come on and really settled us down. And um, real key role for us, um, him doing that. Uh, to be honest. You know, the, the armband still goes to him, that's the respect he's got off everyone, he's our captain. Um, but yeah, he's probably, he knows himself and he, he's been honest enough to say that, you know, maybe he can't start week in, week out, um, but the, the job he does and, you know, to have him in the dressing room with the young players that we got is is, is excellent. Um, he's, a, he's a real leader and, um, yeah, like I say, I think we've got a good, good mixture this season of uh, experience in you. And then once Darren had come on, uh, 70th minute comes along, David Adjiboy picks up the ball in the middle of the park and goes through and scores. It's one all, but an instant response from Worthing to get the second goal. Thoughts on how the boys responded to one all? Yeah, I mean, that's twice now we've gone one nil down and showed great character to come back. Um, like I say, we've got an excellent team spirit in there. Um, and, you know, it, it bodes well when you can do that. Um, yeah, I thought... I thought we, we we had to change shape, um, you know, and put David up front just to, you know, try and try and stretch him a little bit. I thought he could really get at him, and um, you know, lucky it's it's panned out that way, and he's got his couple of goals. Um, you know, some we get lucky with, and, and and some we don't with them sort of changes. But yeah, he's he's, he's um, Callum's work up front as well, to, and he's done brilliant for the, for the second goal. And yeah, I just felt as soon as we scored, we had a bit of momentum then. When we thought, you know, sense we could go and get another one, and you know, full credit to the lads, they you know jumped on that momentum and went and got it. And finally, just looking towards Saturday, Harlow away. How are you going to prepare for it with only maybe one training session to go? Yeah, well, that's it. We'll um, you know again. We'll analyse the two games, see where we can get better, and um, um, yeah, look at look at the first half in particular on where we can improve, um, and then we'll, we'll show the boys Thursday um, those areas and work on them Thursday, and yeah, be ready to to go go again on Saturday. It's a, it's a tough league, this league, you know. There's there's no gimmies. No one's going to hand you three points. You've really got to work and earn them. And I thought they was excellent tonight. A real strong side. They worked their socks off for each other. Um, and any team that comes here and picks up any sort of points, they're going to have to really earn it. And uh, I thought we did that second half. Well, thank you and congratulations on you for the three Cheers, points. Thanks, mate.